I was part of the parental engagement team that brought about this idea of trying to engage parents in a different, more kind of interactive way. That we try and engage pupils to one get more equipped and and build a rapport with staff, but also for to develop a kind of rapport with uh, parents. My role in that then was to think of games that would one kind of make sure that we build numeracy across the curriculum, ensure that the skills for pupils that are the access to curriculum for numeracy and maths are found inside the games. So with that I found five or six games and pass it on to the PT of parental engagement to then purchase the games that were then used for the games night. It made us all interactive with the parents, it got us more communicated, uh, or we communicated better with the parents. We learned what they want and what pupils want and from these discussions we then became a bit more uh, understanding of what was needed to change with how we engage with parents. So I think our interactive skills and our communication skills definitely improved from this uh, uh, games night. My own teaching has changed and now I'm trying to look at more engaging and interactive ways of trying to introduce numeracy topics throughout the school. I think the games that we had were excellent. Um, I feel that the games now are being used in different ways so that we can uh, make learning fun. And I think that's something that has been lost in the past where we have been kind of built on this idea of rigour in maths and we're trying to get rid of that disdain in mathematics and numeracy where we can then build, uh, as I said, a better rapport with the students through these active games. I already had an, an excellent uh, communication with the parents and, the, and the parents do enjoy working and they have worked well with us in the past. What I would say is that as a school, uh, as a, as a school our pupils tend to disappear with the engagement of parents as they go up to school. So starting at S1 and then building along, we're hoping now that the S1 parents will stay with us right up to S6. I feel like getting a certificate was just a sense of a job well done. It made the uh, parents feel that they were a part of the school. It made them feel that they were welcomed by the school and also got a, a job satisfaction of that they're taking uh, more of a role in their, in their pupils' learning. We've had excellent feedback from the goodie bags. We've uh, made sure that the goodie bags included a game so that the games can then be used at home. We have given different ideas of what they could incorporate at home to try and make their son or daughter more involved in their learning outside of school in a more engaging and interactive way. And we've done that through the games that were inside the goodie bags. The parents really enjoyed it. And again, it was this idea of getting more than just turning up and a, a, and a, free, a free meal from some of the food there. So this idea of getting the bag that had a game, um, everything was free, kind of says that we care about the pupils and the, about the parents and I think that was really taken on board with the feedback we've got from that. From the games night we've actually ran an S1 games lunch event every Thursday and the kids that kind of go to that have been told us that they do still regularly use the games and the games that they have used at home they have brought them in the school and we use them in the games club at lunchtime every Thursday. I'm always trying to find engaging ways to make numeracy a bit more fun and fighting games online that actually incorporated this engagement uh, was probably the best bit of it.